Bernissart, 1878. I've struck gold, shouted a miner, 322 meters underground, when he discovered a tree trunk filled with glittering ore. In reality, they were bones encrusted with pyrite, a sparkling gold-colored mineral known as fool's gold. A telegram was quickly sent to the Royal Belgian Natural History Museum. The result was three exciting years of excavation and the discovery of around 30 dinosaur skeletons, many almost intact. 600 blocks of fossils protected in plaster were transported to Brussels and set up in a former chapel whose high ceiling was perfect for the task of solving the giant 3D puzzle. It was a major discovery for paleontology. For the first time, complete skeletons could show us what dinosaurs actually looked like. The shape of their teeth tells us that they were plant eaters. Their pointed horn-covered thumbs were a powerful defense. And their spine was reinforced by bony tendons which connected the vertebrae. Now we know they normally walked on four legs. However, the skeletons that were originally mounted in this upright biped position are too fragile to be remounted. They're still the largest and best preserved collection of iguanodons in the world. They are the stars of our museum.